This is PSPICE simulation tutorial series. In this video, we will run transit analysis on a previously created RC circuit project. So let's get started. In the first step, we'll open Cadence PSPICE project file, which you can download using the link given in the description. To open that file, first we are going to run ORCID capture from Cadence program menu. Then select the license file and click over OK button. Once the ORCID capture is ready, we are going to open the project. Just locate the file where you have downloaded that. In my case, it is on desktop. Here we go. Once project file is open, we are going to open the schematic page. So this is the circuit that we are going to use for transient analysis. Let's zoom fit for the circuit. Now in the next step, after opening this schematic page, we are going to edit this schematic. By replacing this DC source, with a pulse generator and then we'll add pulse generator parameters. To do that, we'll go to place, components, here search for vpulse, right click and click over place button. We are going to place it here, right click, end mode. Let's delete this v1 source and I'm going to name it v1 because since we don't have any v1 source and place it here. Now we are going to add different parameters. So what is the initial voltage we want? We want zero volt. What is the maximum voltage we want in our pulse? One volt. Then we have to add time delay. So let's go for 100 nano. Then we'll go for rise time. So in our case, let's say rise time 10 nano and click over OK. Then fall time one micro. Then we have pulse width. Let's select one second and period will be two. All right. Once we have added all these pulse parameters, we are going to add voltage probes at input and output. And you know that we, are, we can place voltage probe just by clicking over this voltage level marker. So let's place it at input and one at output. Right click and mode. Now, after placing this voltage probes, we are going to create new simulation profile. To do that, we'll click over new simulation profile button. Let's name it transient analysis and click over create button and simulation setting window will open. Now here we have selected analysis type transient runtime. We are going to set for five microseconds. Start saving data zero and rest will be the default setting. Click over apply and OK. Now next we are going to run the simulation. To do that, we'll click over this run piece by simulation button. Once the simulation is ready, we'll just open our simulation plots. And here we can see the transient analysis where we have time on X axis and voltage or gain at Y axis. Here green plot is the input voltage and red plot is the output voltage. So we can see this pulse here. Next, we are going to save this project. To do that, we'll close it. Go to file and click over save button. For more tutorials, visit us at resources.emaeda.com and don't forget to like and subscribe our YouTube channel.